All right, welcome back to Rayleigh Small Engines. Today, we're going to be talking about a PTO switch. And I'm going to try and make this as simple as possible. Um, so hopefully it's not so confusing. One side, you got your COM, C-O-M, which is common, A-B-C. This side will say NC or something like that, normally closed, okay? All this switch does is really simple. It is a just a switch. Now, with that button pushed in, you'll find that that wire or that terminal and that terminal, your outer band, that has contact with that. The center one has contact with that one. This one has contact with that one. Your outsides connect. They don't connect this way in any way. Okay? Now, this is connected to this right now. When I pop this switch out, you go, instead of being connected there to there, that is open now, and then you close not on the NC side, it'll be on the comm side. You'll, you just, when you pull that switch out, you connected that to that, that to that. And nothing here, because there's not a terminal there. And all these switches are different, and with the amount of blades and, and everything, but they all pretty much work the same. Now the way you would test it, on your own setting, I'm going to see if I can put this up to the camera so you can see. We're going to flip this up to our ohms. That's your DC voltage, AC voltage, and right there is your ohm setting. Look like a horseshoe. You feeling lucky? All right. Now we see, I hope y'all can see that. It says OL, overload, whatever you want to call it. Now I touch these together, you're going to see it go to zeros. That means we have continuity. They are joined together, okay? Now, let's take this switch and we're going to close it. Now you'll find that you have continuity between these outer blades. See the meter just go to zero? Take the terminal off, it goes open. Okay, see right there? It goes to zero. Now, watch what happens when I pull the switch. And it doesn't matter red or black, whichever, it does not matter which one you hook to what there. See right there, it's open. There's no connection there when I pulled that switch open. Okay, let's close the switch. Now, we'll have continuity between this blade and that blade. Okay, same thing on the middle. If I can get it in there. I hope I'm not blocking you. I'll see it go to zeros. Means we got continuity there, okay? Now, we'll pull the switch out, and you'll find we're going to go over to the comm side, hook in a terminal there, so we've got continuity. All right, now let's push the switch in, no continuity. Same thing on the next one, we'll do it here. That is an open connection, okay, that's not connected. Right now with that button still in, in, okay, we've got continuity between here and here. So again, we're going to pull the switch. We no longer have continuity here, but we do have it here. Okay, and that's how you test most of your PTO switches. So I hope this helps you guys out. Leave a comment down below. Um, sorry about the noise in the background, guys. We got I got a fan going. South Carolina, hot, humid. Um, got any questions or comments? Love to hear them. Put them down below, and click on one of these videos. I'm sure there's a little box down here or something, or a circle going to come up with my little logo, and you click on that. And subscribe to this little YouTube channel if you like. Hope this helps you guys out. Y'all have a great day. We'll see you next time.